Hi, my name is Ali Ananji and I'm a 1B Knowledge Integration student at the University of Waterloo and I live at Claudette Miller Hall. I'm so excited to show you around today because I remember exactly what it was like to be in your shoes, trying to decide which university to attend, which program, and where to live. Once I decided to attend Waterloo, I spent a lot of time looking at the different campus housing residence options online, so I'm hoping this video gives you a better sense of what Claudette Miller Hall is like. But first, let's talk about University of Waterloo Place, or UWP. UWP is a really diverse residence community and the largest of all of our on-campus residences. It's made up of seven building communities, including Claudette Miller Hall, or CMH. Claudette Miller Hall offers traditional dorm-style living. A traditional room is what you might normally think of when you think of a student dorm. A room with one or two beds, desks, and wardrobes. This is the CMH front desk, and there are assistants here 24 hours a day. The front desk provides so many helpful services. You can get things printed, send and receive mail, or sign out games and equipment. The CMH Great Hall is a great spot to come to for collaboration, teamwork, or even working by yourself, as well as to attend an event put on by Campus Housing. For example, we've had a Super Bowl watch party here and a Halloween party. Welcome to the CMH Games area. Here we have ping pong tables, a pool table, and of course you can sign out the equipment at the front desk. In this space we also have two bookable music rooms, each with a piano you can use, as well as a multi-faith prayer room. Welcome to the CMH Market Eatery. Here at the eatery there are lots of different stations, including the Create Your Own station, where they rotate between Create Your Own Pasta, Curry, and Stir Fry, as well as Create Your Own Omelettes in the morning. There's also pizza, quesadillas, burgers, burrito bowls, and lots more, as well as the largest salad bar on campus. There's also the special station. It's priced by weight, so you only pay for what you take. A lot of the food is made from scratch and purchased locally. You can even get some to go in the micro grocery. I also love the fact there's a booster juice in the CMH Market Eatery. Perfect for grabbing a morning smoothie before class. If you have any dietary needs, the food services chefs are very willing to work with you. For example, I'm a vegetarian and I've never had any trouble trying to find something to eat in the CMH Market Eatery. If you live in CMH or any traditional style of residence, you are required to have a meal plan and you can choose one based on how much you eat. The great thing about our meal plans is that you are able to use your meal plan at any food service location on campus. That includes Starbucks, Tim Hortons, Subway, and more. This is the CMH Fitness Center, which is an awesome perk of living in this building. It's available to all UWP residents. Just tap your walk card to get in. In the gym, we have free weights, cardio machines, as well as weight machines. Here we have the CMH Laundry Room. To use the laundry machines, you can pay with the flex dollars loaded on your walk card. We have washers and dryers, as well as a sink and an ironing table. In addition, we have two study rooms on each floor one on each side of the lounge. These are great spots for working on projects, using the whiteboards, or just hanging out with people on the floor. This is the main lounge area on our floor where we can hang out, study, or use the kitchen. Each community has a Don, who is an upper year student that has experienced the highs and lows of being a student here. My Don really brings us together and helps build community on our floor with floor meetings, one-on-one -on -one check ins, and events. For example, we've had a Mario Kart tournament night, a paint night, and a nacho night. Welcome to my CMH single room. When ranking the different residences and room types, this is the specific combination that I ranked first. All of the furniture was here when I moved in, so I only brought what I really needed to to make it feel like home. For example, my pictures and posters. I really love the giant window in my room. By midday, the sun just streams on in, and I absolutely love it. In terms of the bathrooms on the floor, there are a few of us that share a bathroom, but our class schedules are so different that I've never had to wait. All of our residences have inclusive bathroom options. The bathrooms in this building are all gender bathrooms and they are always clean, which I genuinely appreciate. Living here at CMH, you are close to a lot of really great things in Waterloo. Buses and transit are just outside and the plaza is right across the street so there are lots more options for food and many of them allow you to pay with your walk card. 
If you walk away from this virtual tour with one key message, it should be this. Living in residence is so much more than just four walls and a bed. You can get that anywhere. But what makes the Waterloo residence experience so special is definitely the people here, the community, the great staff, dons, and other students, as well as the opportunities to grow in your academics, socially, and as a leader. It's so nice to have been able to find a community here. So whether home is close by or thousands of kilometers away, choosing to live in residence is absolutely worth it because it really does feel like home.